Well, hello, hockey fans. That's what my favorite, uh, one of my favorite play-by-play -play announcers locally here in Calgary, Ed Whelan. That was his quote. But, uh, anyway, how was the first round for you guys with your brackets here? Was it good? Bad? Horrible? Well, in my case, it definitely was horrible here, but, uh, you know, the NHL gives hockey fans a second chance here, and, uh, in this video, I'm going to go over my uh, bracket picks for my second chance bracket here. But before uh, we do, let's go over the disaster, also known as my first bracket here. So anyway, in the Eastern Conference here, I actually had Tampa Bay beating the Columbus Blue Jackets. That didn't happen. I had Boston beating the Toronto Maple Leafs. That happened. Then I had Washington beating the Carolina Hurricanes. That didn't happen. Then I had the Pittsburgh Penguins beating the New York Islanders. That didn't happen. So only one for four in the East here. At West here, I had Calgary beating the Colorado Avalanche. That didn't happen. I, then I had Vegas beating San Jose. That didn't happen. And then I had Nashville beating Dallas. That didn't happen. And, to sound like a broken record, I had Winnipeg beating St. Louis. That didn't happen. And then my final four, I had the Calgary Flames and the Winnipeg Jets. And the Tampa Bay Lightning and the Washington Capitals there. And then ultimately I had the Flames beating the Tampa Bay Lightning for the Stanley Cup here. That was my first bracket. So overall, if you're keeping track there, I was only one for it's one out of eight there. That's very, very bad there. I wouldn't even cut it for a decent power play here. But don't worry, the NHL.com gave us hockey fans a second chance here. I wonder what prompted them to give the fans a second chance was I apparently heard that 50% of entries had Tampa Bay at least going to the Stanley Cup Finals there and... That didn't happen. They got swept by the Columbus Blue Jacks. In fact, the whole first round was pretty wacky here. So anyway, excuse me, I got my second chance here. So here's my second chance bracket here. As the Colorado Avalanche and the San Jose Sharks are playing in the uh, second round here in the Western Conference. And you got the Dallas Stars playing the St. Louis Blues for the Pacific and the Central here. And then out east, you got the uh, Columbus Blue Jackets, surprisingly, playing the Boston Bruins, but the Boston Bruins are hosting for the Atlantic. And then the Metropolitan, you got the Carolina Hurricanes. They're being hosted by the New York Islanders here. So how did I have my bracket go? Well, I, I decided to take the Colorado Avalanche over the San Jose Sharks here because I've been going I'm going west to east here this time so I got Colorado over San Jose here because I figured that Colorado's got the better goaltending and they're more rested and less banged up from San Jose and Vegas there and then for Dallas and St. Louis here I'm going to say the magic's going to continue for the St. Louis Blues there I, I figured that Dallas St. Louis is going to be a close series here, but uh, you know, I'm starting to believe in the St. Louis Blues here. I mean, after they fired Mike Yo and brought in Craig Berube as head coach, I mean, St. Louis has been playing 750 hockey all the way through, and uh, they were able to beat the Winnipeg Jets and uh, move on here. So I got Colorado and St. Louis playing in the Western Conference Final here. So you got out east here, you got the Boston Bruins and the Columbus Blue Jackets here for the Atlantic. I do have the Boston Bruins advancing because I figure the Boston Bruins, I mean, I still think they're more talented than the Columbus Blue Jackets here, but it will not be a cakewalk here. But, uh, I mean, the Boston Bruins, I mean, I, it's still hard to say, but I think uh, Boston has more talent overall than the Columbus Blue Jackets, but it's been a nice running story for the
Columbus Blue Jackets here, at least, you know, for their franchise. Got their first series win here, but, uh, you know, surprisingly, they knocked out the Tampa Bay Lane. I still can't believe that. So I got the Washington Bruins advancing, and then the Metropolitan here, I got, I actually got the Carolina Hurricanes knocking off the uh, New York Islanders, and I just picked it for Carolina Hurricanes reasons. The funny thing with the Carolina Hurricanes here is that uh, it's either feast or famine with them. They either miss the playoffs badly, or when they get in the playoffs, they go far. Because if you recall here, this is the first time the Carolina Hurricanes have made the playoffs in 10 years here. And they're high off of knocking off the Washington Capitals there in double overtime here. But 10 years ago, when they last made the playoffs, the Carolina Hurricanes were in the Eastern Conference Championship. And they lost to the eventual champion, the Pittsburgh Penguins, who won the Stanley Cup. And then in 2006, they won the Stanley Cup. Thankfully, against the Empton Oilers. And then in 2002, they uh, made a nice run and went all the way to the Stanley Cup Finals and lost to, at the time, the Detroit Red Wings were still in the Western Conference there and lost to them in five games there. So the last three times the Carolina Hurricanes before this season, they've at least gone to the Conference Championship. So I'm just going based on history and picking for Carolina reasons. So my... Final fours, I got Colorado, St. Louis, and Boston and Carolina there. So in my Western Conference final, I have the St. Louis Blues knocking off the Colorado Avalanche. And then as a bonus question, they asked how many games, and I picked six games for the St. Louis Blues to knock off the Colorado Avalanche to get into the Stanley Cup finals for the first time since 1970. So that last time the St. Louis Blues were in the Stanley Cup Finals there was when that famous Bobby Orgel happened. And I think the St. Louis Blues, they've only been to the conference championships twice. I, mean, I think they might have been there three times. I know for sure they uh, they lost to the Flames in 1986 there. And then they lost to the San Jose Sharks in 2016. And I'm not too sure if St. Louis has been to the conference championship but I know they've not been to the Stanley Cup Finals since the first three years they were in existence from the post-expansion era after the 1967 there. So uh, I think the St. Louis Blues, they're going to continue their magic and get to the Stanley Cup Final. Who is going to meet the St. Louis Blues? I actually have the Boston Bruins as going back to 2009 with the Carolina Hurricanes there. The Carolina Hurricanes actually knocked off the Boston Bruins in the Eastern Conference semifinal in the second round there. Game seven in overtime here. So I think the Carolina Hurricanes, or the Boston Bruins, will get their revenge on the Carolina Hurricanes there. That was that, you know, Scott Walker actually came back and haunted the Boston Bruins there. So I do have the St. Louis Blues taking on the Boston Bruins in the second finals there. And uh, the bonus question for the Eastern Conference Championship, I think the Boston Bruins would knock off the Carolina Hurricanes in seven games there. So, Stanley Cup Final, I have the St. Louis Blues and the Boston Bruins here. And for the, they waited 49 years for it, but I do have the St. Louis Blues winning the Stanley Cup over the Boston Bruins. And I picked 22 goals as the goal scored as the bonus question. And they'll do it in six games there. So, uh, St. Louis, you know, if you're, so if my second trance bracket comes out, You'll be happy and you'll finish with your first ever Stanley Cup. Who would have thought that, considering the day when they fired uh, Mike Yo that the St. Louis Blues in this bracket would win the Stanley Cup or have done what they've done. But, uh, you know, this whole playoffs has definitely been wacky here. and uh, There were some head and heart picks there, but uh, after the first round, I got creamed. I almost just don't care anymore. I just hope we have some great hockey leading the way here. But, uh, you know, what's well, your pick for the second round bracket? Second chance bracket here. But, uh, you know, it would be nice to see St. Louis and Boston play each other. You know, St. Louis get revenge 49 years later. And it just maybe be funny if a defenseman scored in overtime and floated through the air for the St. Louis Blues. Uh, it's, it's all fantasy here. But uh, anyway... You know, if you enjoy everything I do on my YouTube channel with all my sports content or 
you know, maybe the odd personal vlog or chance when I try to be funny, attempt to call me there, just make sure you hit like, subscribe there, and follow along, and hit that bell icon, and I always say, yes, I'll see you in the next video.